If you're looking for the best aquarium plant fertilizer, here's a list you must see. We made this list based on our personal preference and sorted it based on their features, prices, quality, durability, and reputation of the manufacturers and customer feedback. Also, we've included options for every type of customer. So let's get started. At the first position of our list, we have Seacom Flourish Freshwater Plant Supplement. The first on my list is a stalwart of hobbyists and serious aquaculturists across the globe. The Seacom brand has a great reputation and, in my opinion, it's well-deserved. A quick look at the bottle shows the full range of macro and micronutrients your tank and plants need. The bottle says shake well before use and never has a truer word been said. The solution will separate into layers if left on a shelf. You really do need to give the bottle a good, hard shake about before dispensing otherwise the dose will be wildly inaccurate. The 500 milliliter bottle is a decent size and 5 milliliter capful will fertilize 80 liters of tank water. One bottle is going to go a long way. Seacombs Flourish also has dissolved copper. Cuba at low enough levels to be safe for shrimp and other crustacea. Moving on to the next and number two with Nylock Aquatics Aquarium Fertilizer Shrimp Specific. Another liquid fertilizer with a slight twist, Nylock G's product is specifically tailored for heavily planted tanks that are populated with crustacea. The nutrient list has been tweaked with respect to the balance of both macro and micronutrients, notably copper and nitrogen. My favorite feature about this fertilizer is the handy pump dispenser. One squirt for five gallons of water, nothing could be easier. The range of nutrients is the same as Seacom's offering, but with amended amounts. Reported results indicate the product works great across the board. Users note no ill effects on fauna and flora that goes from strength to strength. On the downside, this fertilizer's price sits at around double that of the Seacom fertilizer above, and there's a lot less of it in the bottle. However, you really do get what you pay for. The number three position is held by Seacom Flourish Tabs Growth Supplement. Tabs should be buried in the substrate. If you're not sure how many to use, just remember that a 10-gallon tank requires six tabs, and work it out from there. They should be replaced every two to three months, or as needed depending on the tank's ecosystem. You won't have to go fertilizer shopping too often. I like Seacom's range, it's unfussy, and the products do exactly the job they are supposed to do. The nutrient balance is spot on too. Unlike liquid fertilizers, these slow-release tabs help eliminate the possibility of a nitrate spike. The pH balance tabs won't upset the tank's balance or the hardness of the water, which other substrate-based fertilizers may do. One of my pet hates is tabs, or substrates that start to break down as soon as you place them in the water. Not only does it cloud the water, but it also defeats the point of a slow-release system. There's no danger of that here. The tabs are firm, compact, and easy to handle and situate. Next at number 4, we have Aquatic Arts Marimol Moss Ball Food. Aquatic Arts Fertilizer is a left-field addition to the list because it's a special, tailored plant food designed for Marimo moss balls, delightful little algae balls that float by day and sink at night. The Japanese know how to create novelty pets, and these guys certainly qualify. The moss balls need one drop of this fertilizer every few days. A bottle features a handy drop dispenser. The balls should be fed individually, one drop per ball, although no more than three of you are feeding directly into their water and rolled around in your hand to disperse the food across each ball surface. The nutrient balance has been altered to cater specifically for Marimo Moss Balls, one of the only products out there to make this boast. Along with regular water changes, this is the only care your moss balls should ever need, so this is a great all-in-one cure-all. The only downside, if there is one, is that if your moss balls are in a tank with other fauna, they need no feeding, making fertilizer redundant. The number five position is held by API Leaf Zone Freshwater Aquarium Plant Fertilizer. API Leaf Zone is a completely different animal to the previous offerings we've looked at. Where the others had a full range of micro or macronutrients, Leaf Zone contains potassium and iron only. Both are needed for healthy plant growth, so this will give your plants a boost. The fertilizer can be put to good use in a well-established, mature tank that's stocked with fish. Together, the plants in the bioload from the fish create a delicately balanced nutrient cycle. API product acts as a pick-me-up without overloading the floor or fauna with nutrient spikes. The number six position is dominated by Glossofactory All-in-One Planted Aquarium Fertilizer. 
Glosso Factory All-in-One Planted Aquarium Fertilizer is a highly concentrated formula that contains all the nutrients necessary for healthy plant growth. It is easy to use and has clear instructions on the label. The balanced formula provides macro and micro elements, including iron, calcium, magnesium, potassium, and other essential trace elements. Glosso Factory All-in-One Planted Aquarium Fertilizer also contains beneficial bacteria that help remove ammonia from the water column. Just add one pump per 10 gallons of water every other week, and you're done. You don't have to worry about adding trace elements or any extra additives. Glosso Factory All-in-One Plant Fertilizer is entirely safe for all freshwater aquarium plants, including stem plants, floating plants, flowering plants. However, it is safe for both freshwater and saltwater aquariums. Moving on to the next at number 7 with Seacom Flourish Tabs Growth Supplement. Seacom Flourish Tabs are the world's highest purity growth stimulating tablets for plant roots that contain essential trace elements, amino acids, and vitamins. Seacom Flourish Tabs was developed with years of research to supplement aquatic plants for people who love plants but do not have enough time or space to care properly. Made only from natural ingredients, including iron, calcium, magnesium, potassium inositol, choline B12 biotin, and more. Seacom has mastered what it takes to keep your plants happy all year round without nutrients deficiencies. Flourish Tabs are the perfect solution for beginner aquarium owners. They contain all of the same essential nutrients as Flourish, but in a dry, tabular form that can be directly inserted into your aquarium's gravel bed. This provides direct fertilization to your plant's root zone and allows you to control how much fertilizer is released at any given time. These tabs slowly release their nutrients through enzymatic action for weeks or months, depending on usage rates and water conditions. The result is organic, time-release plant food. The number 8 position is held by Aquarium Plant Root Fertilizer Tabs 40 Count. The right plant root fertilizer can make all the difference to your aquarium plants. Aquarium Plant's Root Fertilizer Tabs are a safe and easy way to provide your aquatic plants with vital nutrients. These slow-release root fertilizers dissolve slowly over time, releasing essential nutrients as needed by your live aquarium plants. These root fertilizers contain a balanced blend of macronutrients, including nitrogen and anosphorus, P, potassium, K, and trace elements such as iron, Fe, magnesium, Mg, manganese, Mn. Root tabs are the most effective way to fertilize plants in aquariums. Unlike liquid fertilizers that can be washed away, root tabs slowly release nutrients directly to plant roots for up to three months. Aquarium plant root tabs is an excellent choice for all aquariums as it is an ideal blend of nitrogen, phosphorus, and potassium, and peak eight for healthy plant growth. Each tab is pre-measured for a specific substrate depth, two inches or four inches. Press the tabs into your substrate near the base of rooted plants or three six inches apart or as needed. Replace tabs after three months. Use in tanks with at least one, two inches of substrate. Press tabs deeply into the substrate. Depending on planting density, adjust the tab spacing. Next at number nine, we have API Root Tabs Freshwater Aquarium Plant Fertilizer. API Root Tabs are the ideal choice for promoting robust root development in freshwater aquarium plants. I recommend these root tabs for tanks that handle heavy bio load. API Root Tabs containing essential nutrients including iron, potassium, and carbon provide your aquatic plants with everything they need to get off to a strong start and keep established plants flourishing. Aquarium Plant Fertilizer from API is a superior aquarium plant fertilizer in tablet form. The iron-based formula promotes the lush growth of aquarium plants and supports the development of strong roots. Safe for use with tropical fish, aquarium plant fertilizer can be used to maintain healthy aquarium plants in freshwater planted aquariums. Using this product is a quick and easy way to maintain the health of your aquarium. Add one tablet for every 30 square inches of gravel surface. Push it halfway into the bed and add new tablets monthly for optimum growth. Finally, the number 10 position is dominated by Nylock Thrive Sea Liquid Aquarium Plant Fertilizer. If you are looking for convenience, then the Thrive Sea Liquid Fertilizer is perfect for you. I don't have that much free time to take care of my planted aquarium, so I'm glad that this product exists. I can continue feeding aquarium plants with all the nutrients they need. I do not have to mix and prepare other fertilizers just to get the same results. This best all-in-one aquarium fertilizer is also quite easy to use thanks to its pump dispenser. One pump is enough for five gallons of water. It is the same size as my smallest tank. 
I don't need syringes and measuring cups to treat my aquarium. I just need to point the dispenser into the tank and press on it. This takes out all the hassle of keeping live plants. This aquarium plant food is also quite concentrated, so one bottle can last more than a year. An entire bottle is enough for 2,500 gallons of tap water, dechlorinated and conditioned. This means if you have a small 10-gallon tank, a bottle can last for more than five years if you will be doing complete water changes weekly. This product is safe to use on planted tanks. It does not also contain any copper, so your snails will be safe if you have any of them. If you are keeping shrimp and other invertebrates, you can rest assured that they will be perfectly safe. However, this aquarium plant fertilizer does contain nitrates, so you should use this sparingly if you do not have that many plants in your tank. You may accidentally cause a nitrate spike if you use too much of this product too quickly. It is better to test the water after using this fertilizer. That's all for today. We upload fishing product review videos every single day. So, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon for the upcoming video notification.